Hello Virgo, welcome to Femacy Lighthouse. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another energy reading. Today we'll be taking a look at the recent past, the present, and the future in reference to a love connection that continues to challenge you. To book your private reading with me, all of that info is below along with all of the price listings. Private readings with me are an hour long and the best way to be notified as to when I put out any new content is by following me on Instagram. The link to my IG is below. And as always, not each and every Virgo watching me will feel like this is their story and that's it's okay. It's impossible for me to be able to connect with each and every Virgo in this world. All right, let's get right into what's going on. Spirit, please speak to me in reference to how Virgo's person is feeling in the recent past. Please speak to me about the recent past when it comes to how Virgo's person is feeling. Talk to me about the recent past. A lot of pain that your person is in. Okay, justice. So I feel that your person wants to have peace with you. And at one point, you are nurturing the situation, Virgo. But there's a lot of drama here in the recent past. They want peace. But with all of these swords being present here... There's an energy of disappointment. Someone is not content here in the recent past. All right. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra energy. And then we have Gemini in Libra as well. Okay. Aquarius. Now let's take a look at the present when it comes to how your person is feeling. All right. So Six of Swords energy... Tell me more about how your person is feeling. It's like they want to leave the situation, but they don't have enough strength to walk away from it. There's drama here with the five of wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius could be a fire sign that is either conflicted about something, not wanting issues, but... There are issues here in this connection and somebody refuses to leave or doesn't want to end the situation, but it's chaotic. Tell me more about the present when it comes to the person that Virgo is dealing with. So they want to keep this thing going, but... We have some mental health stuff going on, Virgo, whether it be you or the person that you're dealing with. They keep thinking something that isn't true or creating scenarios that just aren't taking place. They're overthinking is what I'm getting here. Tell me more about Virgo's person for the present. Tell me more about their person for the present, please. Two of Wands. They're on their phone too much. They need to stop. They need to take a break from social media. Social media is influencing drama here, is what I get. Talk to me about the future when it comes to Virgo and the person that they're dealing with. Ten of Cups energy. So there's potential for this to turn around. That was too many. Let me put them back. Yeah, so Ten of Cups. Things are going to get better in the future. Tell me more about the future when it comes to Virgo and the person that they're dealing with. Tell me more about the future. Yes, things will improve. Two of Cups energy and the Ten of Cups, two of the happiest cards in this deck. All right, it's like you guys are having a lot of issues right now, but you both want the same thing. That's why the future looks beautiful here with the Ten of Cups, Two of Cups, two people coming together. All right, 
Tell me more about the future when it comes to Virgo and the person that they're dealing with. The moon card. Tell me more. Yeah. So I really feel that there's going to be more communication between you guys in the future. And someone is being empathetic, sympathetic here really wanting to be supportive, whether it be you or the person that you're dealing with. And there's a positive outcome here with the Ten of Cups in the future. So I know that it seems really heavy right now, but in the days ahead, it looks like everything starts to clear up for your situation. All right, because this is how either you or the person that you're dealing with is feeling right now. You see the Eight of Swords, somebody's mentally trapped but someone is doing this to themselves they're overthinking a lot of it has to do with being on their phone is what i'm getting here all right so um thank you so much for watching to book your private reading all of that info is below the best way to be notified as to when i put out any new content is by following me on instagram that link is below as well thank you and take care